how to train a Wing Chun wooden dummy without having a Wing Chun wooden dummy. I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. If you want to learn more Wing Chun wooden dummy techniques, make sure you check out the playlist. I have many lessons on how to practice with the Wing Chun dummy. If you want to get more lessons like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel, comment, let me know what you want to learn, and like this video and share with friends. So with that said, let's get on with the lesson. First move in the Wing Chun Wooden Dummy form is this one. One, and then two, and three. Okay, so one again. One, two, and three. So if you want to learn how to do that on the actual Wooden Dummy, make sure you check out the Wooden Dummy section one video I have in the description. So how do you train with the Wooden Dummy? Well, we're going to train how to use it in actual practice, or actual application. So this one is basically a straight punch, and then a grab, and then a right palm, and then a grab again. The application is I want to punch in, double back, uh, grab, and then palm. It can be grab and palm down here. It doesn't have to be a palm. It can be a punch. It can be an overhand. It can be an elbow. But I'm grabbing and attacking. You can train this with a partner just like that. Or if you don't have a partner, you can do the wooden dummy training without a wooden dummy. Just practice this, right? Just practice going up, grab, palm, and then double grab, okay? So this way is gonna be up, with a straight punch, grab, palm, and then double grab. And take a step with each one. So you can just be walking in the park or do this at home. Punch, grab, double grab, okay? So punch and parry here. Punch and parry, grab and palm, and double grab. Now you get good at one side, now do the other side. So punch and parry, grab, palm, and double grab. Okay, so once again, show you a demonstration. Punch, okay. punch, right? I can palm here, but his shoulder's in the way. I punch, and then double grab, right? Boom, palm, and then double grab. And that gets him a balance to set up for other attacks, right? So punch, double grab. You can just go right to the double grab without the punch, right? Or you can go one, punch, right? And then double grab. So either double grab, you can go on top, two hands on top, or one hand underneath. Grab his elbow, this is a nice grab. Get both hands, and you do this one. The next part of this section is the bong cell. The next part of this section is the bong sao, tan sao, and dai zhe, right? Or this way, bong sao, tan sao, and dai zhe. So you can just practice that by itself without a wooden dummy. So all you have to do is just bong sao, shift to one side, steps to the side, do a tan sao, and then do a low palm like this. Just pretend there's a wooden dummy here. Okay. Or you can do the other side. Okay, so do alternate sides. Bong sao, tan sao, tai zheng. Bong sao, tan sao, tai zheng. Keep doing that. Look at that, okay? So how do you use this in your application? When, let's see when he does a job, and then you, you block like this. So what you want to do is you step to the side, bong, and then do attack here. Another thing you do is turn the tan into a grab. So he does it, you can grab, and then the tai zheng can be actually a punch too, okay? So if, it, if it's open like this, then I would punch here. If his shoulder is down, open like this, and I would punch over the top. This way, or this way, whichever one you can reach him. Another very good drill you can do without a Wing Chun dummy is the Bong Sao rolling back fist. Okay, so all you have to do is just do a Bong Sao Wu Sao like this. Pretend you're grabbing his arm, and then you roll your hand over and do a back fist. And then you go back and do Bong Sao, Pretend you're grabbing his arm, and then you roll over, you grab this over, do a back fist. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Do this side. One, two, three. Bong Sao is here, Wu Sao is here. Grab, bring the hand 
like this. Over, back fist. Wang sao, wu sao, grab, back fist. Okay, so how this is used is, um, let's say you're, you're a south paw, and then you, you, that's a punch, I bong, grab, over, pull this in, and then back fist, like that, okay? Or if he does this side, right? Bong, pull, back fist, okay? Bong sao, see I have this here, in case um, he punches here, I have this to defend too, okay? So when you're practicing, you can do it just like this, Right? Okay? And now you can do it with stepping. So you go bong, back fist. Bong sao, wuzao, back fist. So take a step each time you do it. Boom, 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 boom. Go this way. Boom, 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 boom. Like that. So that's how you train the Wing Chun Wind Dummy without a Wind Dummy. Because now, if you know how to use the attacks, you can just Imagine the attacker and defending yourself against him and countering using the techniques, coordinating with your steps, and then just practicing that movement in the air. It's just like shadow boxing, and you get to practice your coordination and your timing and also your power.